you can't hide from the G-Man! Aw, oh, too bad Doc's laid up. He's missing all the fun. What fun? The jelly that thing spews is as toxic as nuclear waste. We're just lucky Godzilla chased it out of New York Harbor, or we'd have a major contamination problem on our hands. side of the bed. Instrumentation is malfunctioning. Does anyone else have a bad feeling about this? Unstable atmospheric anomaly of immeasurable strength. You've been uh, moonlighting on the Weather Channel. I don't like the way that storm is still sitting up there. Radio's dead. Nothing but static. All other systems are back online. But the sonar's clear. Clear. Then where are Godzilla and that mutation? Could the storm have forced them so deep they've moved out of sonar range? Monique. Do a sweep. Hmm. Heck, it's been two hours with no electronic or visual contact. Maybe Godzilla just headed home without us. When did Heat Headquarters become a fixer-upper? Doc must have had some party. Mendel? Oh, man. Every computer, the cameras, even the coffee machine, toast. This has to be Doc's idea of a practical joke. We must be on one of those hidden video shows. Godzilla's lair. What happened? The storm? I don't think so. Plant growth like that should have taken decades. Still think this is a TV show? Yeah. The Twilight Zone. I've been up and down the dial, Effie. Nothing. So much for the city that never sleeps. playing dominoes with the World Trade Center. Does that answer your question?
whole city looks like a like a war zone. Those cars, they don't exactly look like this year's model. Check this out. Ghostbusters 10. Am I missing something here? Yeah, parts three through nine. I know this is gonna sound crazy, but what if we're in the future? I mean, maybe we've been caught in some sort of time vortex. You're right. It does sound crazy. No, no, wait a minute, Hefe. Everything has been kind of wacko since we went through that storm cloud. I'm a scientist. Hey, Einstein, look around. It is the only viable explanation. Who are you? The dude who's saving your butts! Duck! I thought we gave that thing a permanent headache! That thing's a dragma, and there are thousands of them! There's a storm drain by the subway station! Go, go, go! Kid's kinda bossy, isn't he? We're about to meet the wizard. I found some stragglers. They're a little weird. Bring them to me. If there's one thing I hate more than taking orders, it's taking orders from a ten-year-old. This way. Manda. Long time no see. You're alive. So are you. I hate to admit it, Doc, but I'm really glad to see you. Everything's changed since your disappearance. <coughs> Maybe not everything. Disappearance? You chased that mutation into the open ocean, but only Godzilla returned. I think we were caught in a time vortex. Considering you haven't aged a day since I last saw you, I'd say that's possible. What year is this? 18 AD. That's after Dragma. But by the Roman calendar, it's 2022. Nigel? Doc, recon patrol reports Nami fighting in sectors 9 and 12. That's my voice. Well, still a few glitches. Mendel, where's Godzilla? Statues are memorials. He died a hero, Nick, allowing millions to escape during the Second Great Siege. But even he was no match for the Dragmas. And Audrey? Last I heard, she and her husband were heading south to New Zealand. Fewer Dragmas there. If you can survive the open ocean. This is the war room. Unfortunately, we're mostly on the defensive these days. Mendel, what exactly are we dealing with here? Genetically created mutations. Highly adaptable, sulfuric acid-based circulatory systems, impenetrable exoskeletons, accelerated regenerative powers. It didn't take long before the Dragmas wiped out most of the planet. Animal took these images just before going MIA, but his legacy remains. Legacy? I'm his son. Excuse me, Dr. Craven, but if I don't get home soon, my mom is gonna thrash me. Dismissed. How many humans are left? A few hundred in New York. A few thousand across the states. Some hide, some fight. All are hunted. Red alert! Sector 32 is getting munched! I'll take point! You mean, we'll take point. Nice to have you back. Let's rock and roll, Happy. I don't really sound like that, do I?
have a guy figured out. Raven missed! Guess again! Pretty impressive, Mendel. Unfortunately, I've had a lot of practice. Inside! Status. Drags, 360 this location. We have a frenzy on our hands. So what else is new? Major Hicks? Nick? You haven't changed a bit. And you, are you all right? Not bad. We've all lost something in this war. My losses are just a bit more obvious. These things must have a weakness. Not any that we found. The Dragmas were genetically engineered to be perfect killing machines. Engineered? By whom? Dr. Jonathan Inslee. Never heard of him. If this dude Inslee built him, he must know how to stop him. Inslee's dead. By the time we tracked him down, it was too late. The military was in tatters. I freed every mutation on Monster Island. Nothing helped. The drag was adapt too quickly. Time is not on our side. But it might be on ours. That time storm may still be raging out there. If it brought us forward in time, maybe it could take us back. Allowing us to finish the Dragmas before they start. Your battle's not here, it's in the past! Find Inslee, stop him! Save our future! You look like I smell. Take this. I think it'll do me more good in the past than it does in this present. Just make sure I don't barbecue any of you by mistake. Mendel, I... Good luck. You could come home with us, Doc. I belong here. I'll see you at headquarters. I've waited 23 years for that. I never thought I'd be so happy to see bad weather.
Mendel about Mendel? Nothing. Where have you guys been? Visiting an old friend. Randy. Well, while you were off having fun, my humidifier broke. I ran out of nose drops, and I think I'm getting bronchitis. Randy, download everything you can on Inslee. Elsie, grab the tasers. Monique, prepare the heat copter for immediate departure. What's going on? You guys are running around like it's the end of the world. Not if we can help it. Mendel, let's move. Now? But I'm sick. Uh, honestly, Nick, I, I, you don't know what I've been through. Dr. Jonathan Inslee, genetic engineer, founder and president of American Technologies. What's this? Whoa. Inslee has his own website. The Democratic Resurgence Against the Global Mechanized Armageddon. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Not when you abbreviate it. D-R-A-G-M-A. Dragma. Mm-hmm. And evidently, Inslee's recipe for saving the world is making humans the main ingredient. You have a location? A warehouse on Montauk Point, tip of Long Island. Let's go. Go? Go where? Oh, nobody tells me anything. Knock, knock. Dr. Inslee, I presume. What do you think you're doing? Yeah, what do we think we're doing? Go with it, Mendel. We're here to pull the plug on your little Dragma project. Why? How do you... Let's just say we've had the displeasure of seeing your handiwork up close. My creations will force mankind to embrace a simpler time. Yeah, the Stone Age. Computers run our lives. We're lost without our cars and cell phones and microwaves. Mankind's demise is inevitable. Technology must be stopped. And we're gonna start right now. Trash everything. What are those? Doc, meet the Dragmas. Dragmas, Doc. The exoskeletons aren't as developed as they are in the future. They're vulnerable. You're not leaving the party early, are you, Dr. Inslee? I have to save the world. You just did. I didn't know I had it in me. I did. And who knows? You may not have to wait 23 years for another. <laughs>